hello guys welcome to my channel you are watching how to fix stack in this video i am going to show you five steps how you can resolve the issue aeroplane is stuck and it is not going to turn off in first step we need to try the aeroplane mode turn off it from setting go to setting for that click on start menu then click on setting option now you will see more options here click on network and internet click on this on the left side you will see the option of aeroplane mode click on aeroplane mode and this is the toggle you can turn it off like this if this toggle button is not working on your system you need to move on to the second method make sure its service is running in the background press window press r button together and type as services.msc click on ok button now click on radio management press r button you can see the first option radio management service make sure it is running and uh, you can see in my system the status is running double click on it if it is not running and select the startup type automatic which i have already chosen if the service status is stopped so you need to run it or you need to start it if it is already running like this in my case so you can disable this option you need to disable this option when it is already running hit apply okay now double click on it and re-enable it start select automatic hit apply and then okay as you can see the service is running here make sure it is running so we have enabled the radio management services which is directly related to wi-fi and the aeroplane mode then close it and check your issue is fixed or not if still facing same issue move to third method in third method we are going to update and disable the power management plan press window plus r button together type here dev mz mt dot msc like this dev mz mt dot msc click on ok button now this will take you to the device manager option you need to expand the network adapter here and choose your wi-fi adapter and wi-fi driver here in my case this is this one intel dual band wireless ac right click on it this option and go to properties go to power management and make sure it is untick if it is ticked like this untick this option allow the computer to turn off this device to save the power turn off this option like this hit ok and see the changes and also you can update your driver right click on it and update the driver if you are using the outdated driver this may cause the issue so your issue should be fixed make sure you are choosing the latest driver you can also choose this option if the you are getting this option the best driver for your device are already installed search on updated driver on windows update you can also try this option and make sure you are choosing the latest windows if you are getting any update your windows you can see the download and install option here and also you can click on check for update make sure you are using the latest windows now close this option and see if your issue is solved or not now if you are still facing same issue with applying three methods we are going to perform fourth method which is by the command prompt open the cmd which is command prompt and right click on it run as administrator click on yes option and then type here the command ip config space slash flush dns now this command will flush all the cache inside your dns hit enter and you will get the message like this successfully flush the dns resolver and one more command you can try 
now you can type net sh space int space ip space reset this will reset your ip and you will see the message like this now restart your system and check your issue should be fixed now we have applied four method uh, fourth method is advanced method by the cmd and in five method we are going to reset our pc this is this is the last resort for all the users or you can reinstall the window click on reset this pc if the all the methods are not working on your system you can try this method click on keep my files and then click on next now this option is safe for uh, the your personal files and data but still you can backup your data now these are the programs we are going to install uninstall and only the program will be uninstalled with this method but your files will be safe but make sure you back backup your data if anything goes wrong so your data will be lost so this is the last option you can reset or reinstall the window make sure if you have any physical key with the function key so you can try turn off and on so these are the five methods you can troubleshoot the wi-fi is stuck on the aeroplane mode hope this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix that